find the uh, find an equation of the parabola with the horizontal axis which contains the points 2 0 0 1 and 0 7 find its vertex focal distance focus and directrix from the previous video na solve natin to using the general equation of the parabola yan ito yung solution natin sa previous video so ang ginawa natin diyan uh ginawa natin diyan we created three equations tapos sinulod natin yung values ng d e and f and then um we come up with this equation y squared minus 7 over 2x minus 8y plus 7 equals 0 and then we transform that to the vertex form standard form and then we compute uh, we locate the vertex the focus the focal distance and the equation of the directrix now we're going to solve the same problem using a different approach gawin natin gamitin na din natin yung standard form imbes na yung general form okay before before that let's plot first the points so we have 2 0 2 0 so we have 2 0 and then 0 1 and 0 7 obviously kung horizontal axis your parabola either opens to the left or to the right lang so mukhang hindi naman pa ganito no so I, I can find a way para mas sketch tas tatamaan yung tatlong points na to tapos yung parabola mo uh, opens to the left so feeling ko it opens to the right so uh, yan so let's have a rough sketch of the parabola so feeling ko ito yan uh, not the really the nicest parabola na ulitin natin <laughs> okay so again let's sketch the parabola Sorry. Oh, it's a, it's a pa. Let's sketch the parabola. It's a pa. It's a pa. It's a pa. It's a pa. Okay. Sige. Last na to. Last na to. Dito ko tayo magsimula. Ay, sige. Dito na. Yan. Sige ba? I think this, this, this will work. Okay. Yan. Now, um, ang maganda dito, we can use this graph para maunti na lang yung ating computing mamaya. Okay. So, katulad nung ginawa natin sa, sa, sa isang video, gawin natin, um, we will substitute ulit itong mga points na 2, 0, 0, 1, 0, 7, tapos isolve natin yung mga unknowns. But this time, we will be using the standard form instead of the general form. Stand for, standard form nito, you can review our previous discussions. But uh, the standard form, since this is a parabola that opens to the right, so ang my square dito yung y. So we have y minus k squared equals to the right, so positive 4p x minus h. Yeah. Sa previous video, sinabshoot natin yung 2, 0, 0, 1, 0, 7, tapos nagkaroon tayo ng tatlong equations. This time, huwag muna tayo mag-substitute kasi if you will notice, ang nawawala sa atin ay k, p, at saka h. So, pwede rin naman, eh, substitute nyo na to. But if you will notice, let's go back to the to the graph. Yung parabola sa kanyang axis of symmetry. Di ba yung axis of symmetry, hinahati niya yung parabola. What you see on the left side, you also see on the right side. Now, if you will notice, we have 7 and, uh, so this point, 0, 1, and 0, 7 located on the same vertical line. So, ibig sabihin, para silang magka-mirror point, uh, mirror points sila. So, nasa gitna nila dumaan ang axis of symmetry. Tama? So, ano ang gitna ng 1 at 7? So, in this case, I think we can count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3. So, feeling ko 4. 
Tama, 4 ba? 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. Yeah, tama, 4. So, ibig sabihin, dumaan si axis of symmetry kay 4. So, the equation of the axis of symmetry is, let's write here, axis of symmetry. Equation is, tumama siya sa y-axis, no? So, y equals 4. Yan. So, ibig sabihin, yung vertex natin at saka yung focus, meron din silang y-coordinate na 4. Tama? So, ibig sabihin, si focus at si vertex ay may y-coordinate na 4. Ibig sabihin, si k ay 4 na. So, we really don't need to solve for, for k. So, this will become y minus 4 squared equals 4 p x minus h. So, we will left with p and h na lang isosolve natin. Okay. Sige, substitute pa rin natin. Let's use points 2, ah, sorry, point 2, 0. So, this is x, y. Let's substitute. So, this will become 0 minus 4 squared equals 4 p x minus h. So, x is 2. 2 minus h. So, 0 minus 4 is negative 4. Squared is 16. So, we have 16 equals, let's distribute this. We have 8p minus 4, na ba na una? h or p? h. hp. Okay. So, let's call this equation number 1. Okay, game. Let's substitute uh, 0, 1. 0, 1, so this is your x, y, so 0, sorry, uh, ito yung equation, nalilito ako, ito dapat yung, uh, sorry, sorry, kailangan, ito yung makita natin, so, tanda natin ha, yun, yun doon tayo mag-substitute, okay, so ito yun, ito, 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 ito. So, ang y natin is 1. So, we have 1 minus 4 squared equals 4 p x is 0 minus h. So, we have 1 minus 4 is negative 3 squared 9 equals 4 p times negative h. Because 0 minus h is negative h. So, we're left with 9 equals negative 4 hp. Okay. So, let's call this equation number 2. Now, let's substitute 0, 7. So, we have x, y. 7, y is 7 minus 4 squared equals 4p. Your x is 0 again minus h. 7 minus 4 is positive 3 squared is 9 equals 4p times negative h. So, we have 9 equals negative 4hp. If you will notice, magkapareha si 2 at si 3. Yan, pareha sila. Now, what can you notice? I'm sure si 2 at si 3 parehas. How about, how about 1 and 2? 1 and 2. Correct. Pareha silang may negative 4hp. So, ibig sabihin, we can substitute negative 4hp with 9. So, we, we will have from equation 1 and equation 2, substitute 4hp with 9 because 9 equals negative 4hp. So, ito, itong 9, ipapalit natin dun sa 4hp na nandito sa kabila. Okay, so we have 16, I'm copying equation 1, 16 equals 8p, yung 4hp, papata na siya ng 9, plus 9. So, let's solve for p, so 16 minus 9 equals 8p, 16 minus 9 is 7, 7 equals 8 P, therefore, P equals 7 over 8. Now, this is already your focal distance. Yeah, parehas ba siya? 
Correct. Parehas na dun sa dati nating na-solve sa last video. So, parehas. So, P equals 7 over 8. Now, we can substitute this kanino. Kay first or kay, se kay second na lang, no? Para mas madali. So, let's use equation number 2. Equation number 2. Sorry. I'm going to use a different color. It's okay. Equation number two. So equation two. Let's substitute. We have nine equals negative four HP. Let's substitute P. So we have nine equals negative four. Seven over eight. H times seven over eight. Yeah. So. May negative 4 dito, may 8 dito. So, makakancel na tong 4. May iwan dito ay 2. So, we will left with 9 equals negative 7h over 2. Multiply everything by 2. So, we have um, 18 equals negative 7h or h equals negative 18 over 7. So, this is your H. So, kompleto na. Kompleto na yung uh, kulang sa ating equation. So, mula dito sa equation na to, let's substitute everything that we have. So, we have Y minus 4 squared equals 4P. So, we have 4 times 7 over, sorry, 7 over 8 times x minus h. So, since negative tong h natin, so it will become plus. Plus 18 over 7. Simplify. y minus 4 squared equals 4, 7 times 8. It will become 7 over 2. x plus 18 over 7. Let's see whether we have the same equation katulad nung na-compute natin dun sa previous video. Yes, pareha sila. This one. Ah, 7, y minus 4 squared, 7 over 2, x plus 18. So, again, parang ito lang din yun. Vertex is here. Focus, the focal distance, and the equation of the directrix.